हे गाइज वेलकम टू फ्री शिक्षा टुडे वी हैव अ वेरी एक्साइटिंग मेथड ऑफ फाइंडिंग आउट स्क्वायर्स ऑफ नंबर्स फ्रॉम वन टू हंड्रेड इफ यू लव मैथमेटिक्स इफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर कैट जी मैट जी आर ई और इवन आई आई टी जेई और इवन इफ यू डू नॉट लाइक मैथमेटिक्स दैट मच यू वुड लव दिस मेथड बिकॉज इट मेक्स द कैलकुलेशन रियली ईजी एंड रियली फास्ट so uh, first of all you have to know the squares of numbers from 1 to 30 now yeah that's a that, that should not be a problem because uh, normally students who are preparing know the squares of numbers from 1 to 15 or probably 20 so finding out the squares for 10 more numbers might not be that big a problem so yes you will have to memorize the squares from 1 to 30 after that it becomes really exciting so the trick one let's say we have to find out the square of numbers between 31 to 50 so let's say 41 square so 41 can be written as 50 minus 9 and uh, we can find out the square of minus 9 that is 81 so 81 will become the last two digits of the square of 41 and moving forward the first two digits will be 25 minus 9 which is equal to 16 and 25 is basically 25 is taken as a standard number which can be used for all calculations between 31 to 50 and hence the number will become 1681 hope that is clear Uh, 16 comes from 25 minus 9. 9 was the number which was deducted from 50, and 81 came from minus 9 square. Now, something that you have to keep in mind is that suppose we are finding the square of 36. Now it will become 50 minus 14. Uh, what will be the first two digits, guys? can you find that out so we just have to do 14 square and that is 196 so 96 will be the square right so 96 will be the last two digits and the 1 196 is the number so 1 will be taken as a carry over for first two digits what will be the first two digits well 25 minus 14 plus 1 so 25 was a standard number as i said before and we have to deduct 14 and we have to add 1 because 1 uh, was the carry over from 14 square minus 14 square so that comes out to be 12 hence hence 36 square comes out to be 1296 now trick 2 suppose we have to find the squares of numbers between 51 and 80 let's say 67 square so that can be written as 50 plus 17 and what is 17 square that is 289 obviously this is going to help us in finding out the last two digits and yes directly we can write 89 as the last two digits of 67 square now two gets carried over and the first two digits are 25 plus 17 plus 2 equal to 44 25 was a standard number as we said before and this time we will not be subtracting 17 because 17 is added to 50 so 17 will be added this time and we'll add 2 as carry over and that will give us 44 the number will be 4489 trick 3 now we have to find out the squares between 81 and 100 let's say 82 so last two digits will be how much This time, guys, we'll be subtracting it with 100, 82, uh, 100 minus 82. That gives us 18. That is, and actually 82 minus 100. So that gives us minus 18. And minus 18 square is 324. 3 will be taken as a carryover. And uh, so 3 will be taken as a carryover. Last, sorry, this will be first two digits. I have mentioned this wrongly. And first two digits will be 18, 82 minus 18 plus 3. this time we are not taking 25 we will take whatever the number is whatever number square we are finding out so 82 we have taken this time not 25 82 minus 
because uh, the number is below 100 so we have to uh, uh, use a minus sign 82 minus 18 plus 3 that gives us 67 and the calc calculation comes out to be 6724 82 square is 6724 go ahead guys find the